गुड मॉर्निंग डेयर स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज द सेकेंड वीडियो ऑफ ज्योग्राफी चैप्टर सेवन चैप्टर नेम इज लाइफ लाइन ऑफ नेशनल इकोनॉमी एंड दिस वीडियो इज फॉर द स्टूडेंट ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड टेन स्टूडेंट्स इन आवर प्रीवियस वीडियो वी जस्ट कवर द टॉपिक दैट वॉज द रेल रोडवेज एंड वी रेड अबाउट द मेरिट्स ऑफ रोडवेज स्पेशली आई जस्ट टोल्ड यू टू फोकस ऑन द गोल्डन कॉर्डर लिटरल देन आफ्टर दैट एन एच ए आई इस इम्पॉर्टेंट नेशनल हाईवे इस हाईवे नंबर वन हाईवे नंबर सेवन एट फिफ्टीन ओके सो दीज आर इम्पॉर्टेंट हाईवे विच यू हैव टू जस्ट लर्न एंड वी जस्ट कवर द कॉरिडोर एंड गोल्डन कॉरिडेट्रल विच कनेक्ट्स फोर मेगा सिटीज दैट इज बॉम्बे दिल्ली चेन्नई एंड कोलकाता हेयर वी आर गोइंग टू रीड अबाउट द रेलवेज सो इफ यू जस्ट चेक आउट द हिस्ट्री ऑफ रेल रेलवेज so it is about 150 years old and first rail was started in 1853 between mumbai and thane so it connects state capital with capital of india so what it connects was this is important so it connects state capital with capital of india it also connects major towns and cities tourist places mining centers seaports airports etc so basically the idea of the britishers was there behind the construction and uh, settlement of the railways here to reach to the ore site directly and to carry and forward that ore directly to the seaport that was the intention of the britishers for the construction of railways over here there are about more than 7000 stations and 63000 km long railway track indian railway is divided into 16 zones for proper administration now check about the zones that uh, currently how many zones are there because one zone increased in south india now if we talk about railway in uh, in india have three gauge system first is the broad gauge which is 1.676 meter and meter gauge that is 1.0 meter narrow gauge that is 0.762 and 0.610 meter There are various types of train running in India, such as Rajdhani, Shatabdi, Mail and Express, local and special train, which carry passengers. Obviously, it carry not only the passenger, it carry the goods also. About eighty percent of freight, that is goods, and seventy percent of passenger traffic is carried by railways. So this is not hidden, uh, and we are knowing that uh, how many people at a time can be just carry. from one place to another can just travel from one place to another easily so hundreds of people just uh, can just move from one place to another together that is the advantage of the railways and misfortune of our country is this one you can see here that uh, how people are just taking the risk they are just sitting on the engine standing on the engine okay so this is our condition in our india what is the condition of railway this second picture is more horrified you can see so many improvement is required in railways so computerized reservation system waiting room facilities on stations catering facility electrification on of tracks then unigaur system replacement of uh, steam engine with electric engine many where you have seen also that electric engine is in use but still in some places uh, we use the traditional system special trains like rajdhani shatabdi jan shatabdi etc so here we just uh, uh, found some improvement also that uh, now we can just book our ticket online waiting room facilities are available okay catering facilities are also available tram track also uh, electrification work is going on so these are some improvement which is required next is pipeline when we talk about pipeline so it means it is just like pipe and uh, the way which uh, the way by which we gets the water in our house via pipe okay or with the help of pipe in same manner goods and uh, sir, goods can be also just export from one place to another which is in liquid form okay so pipelines are used to transport gas and liquid materials such as mineral or refined oil natural gas water or even milk okay because milk water and uh, refined oil minerals so these are the liquid form so this can be just exported from one place to another 
okay later on i will show you that how pipeline are just uh, set up so gas pipeline you might have heard uh, oil pipeline that also you might have heard milk pipeline uh, till now it is not in practice pipelines are found from oil producing centers to oil refinery plants and for and from oil refinery plants to the market that is city okay so directly pipeline can just produce you this type of facility mineral oil from upper assam is transported to barani and allahabad oil refinery through pipeline so this is example of pipeline that how from higher altitude the oil can transported easily to the lower slopes so directly if you want to just uh, uh, transport the oil or the liquid or natural gas from one place to another so this is the fastest and safest means of transport pipeline from salaya to jalandhar via mathura and delhi is also very important pipeline so these are some basic information which you need to learn then the longest pipeline in india that is hbj pipeline which connects hazaria bijapur and jagdishpur it is about 1700 km long okay now advantage of pipeline is what it is best for transportation of gas and liquid materials example oil natural gas water and milk construction of pipeline is cheaper than road and railways because you need to only construct the pipes you need to, not to just worry much okay for that purpose you need, don't need to just hire any station master or any person to look after that how it is passing okay proper maintenance is only required pipeline can be constructed in forest swampy areas hills and desert it can also be laid down under river and ocean water that's why uh, pipeline is more convenient in comparison of other transport it means railways pipeline can ensure regular quick and on demand supply of liquid and gaseous materials until or unless the resource will not just end over there till then it can just gives the surety of the regular supply pipelines can be operated at low energy cost and it goes not and it goes not pollute environment so it is not polluting environment anyway you can see this is the pipeline how it is constructed okay and how much distance it used to cover it is not damaging anything and uh, no person is required also you can see this is the pipeline some images of pipeline and with the help of that you can just transport your uh, goods from one place to another which is in liquid state or gaseous state thank you very much thank you for watching